Yeah, sir, tell me. I am Sanjay Kumar, Executive Director of Samgundi Microsoft Society, Gulbarga. Gulbarga district is located in the northern part of the Karnataka state and lies between the district is the biggest district in the state covering 8.49% of the area and 5.9% of the population of the state. Gulbarga is a drought prone area. The average rainfall is 777 mm and the normal rainy days are only 46 in a year. The climate is very hot during the summer which affects adversely and the work capacity of the people. The temperature ranges between 42% centigrade in summer to 26% in winter. The period from December to May is the driest part of the year. There is a high growth rate of population that is from 2.1% during 1991 and highly increased in, in, in the current year and it is one of the low literacy districts in the state. It is placed at the second lowest position. 40% of the total workers are agricultural laborers. This is well above the state average of 26%. The population of non-workers is as high as 56.6%. The proportion of ST and ST settled cost and settled tribe population is 36%. This indicates social backwardness and high incidence of poverty in, in the district. The district economy is mainly an agriculture economy as agriculture contributes 31.7% of district income and provides employment to close to 30-35% of the population. The last part of the land is under dry land cultivation and the area under irrigation is only 18.8% of the net area sown in, in the district. The district has very low female literacy and the enrollment of girl is still below that of boys. In rural areas of Talukas like Kulpurga, Chincholi, Yakir, Shahapur, the enrollment is, is still lower than the urban, compared to urban. Women work as marginal workers and the concentration in agriculture as agricultural laborers indicates the marginalization and existence in poverty trap. Women bear double burden of work with nutritional deficiencies and 99% of sterilization being reverse to many cases support the view of that women still suffer from discrimination and deprivation in this backward region. Migration of people from Gulbarga to other part of country is huge. It is estimated that more than 60% of people in the villages migrate every year to a big metro such as Hyderabad, Bangalore. Mumbai in search of work leaving their loved one behind. There is no enough livelihood opportunities available in the villages. So the people of a uh, village, they migrate to the biggest cities in, in searching of the livelihood opportunities.